Jason Day's British Open campaign is in jeopardy with the Australian aggravating a wrist injury he picked up at last month's US Open. Only 20 players managed to shoot under par rounds on a dramatic opening day. As Nick Lockyer reports, Adam Scott is square with the card and the best of the Australians. As the crowds flocked to Muirfield, Phil Mickelson's quest for a maiden claret jug started with so much promise. Oh, this putt is steaming hot today. Good Lord, three in a row. Two under through the first three holes, but as the greens dried up, so did his short game, leaving lefty furious. Uh, well, the greens are dying and uh, the holes are on, on edges of slopes that uh, the ball just simply won't stay. Well, hopefully they'll, they'll uh, like I say, let go of their ego and set it up reasonable but he's joined at two under by Tiger Woods whose round varied from the brilliant smarter than the average bear what a brilliant putt to the ugly frustrations again leveled at open organizers but former champion Marco Mira who sits just one shot off the pace can't seem to understand what all the fuss is about you know these guys are good they should be able to play in these conditions I just didn't see it unfair he trails fellow American Zach Johnson, who leads at five under. Adam Scott is the best-placed Australian, the Masters champion, draining a pair of monster parts on his way to an even par 71. And some three for Adam Scott. Rory McIlroy's horror year continued, an eight over 79, leaving the former world number one in great danger of missing the cut. A dummy spit saw Charles Schwartzel's six iron cop more abuse than the greenskeepers. And from broken clubs to broken lenses, Thomas Bjorn lost focus in the rough, ending this cameraman's day early. Nick Lockyer, 10 News.